Hi, my name is Kimberly Howard from Zeven Development. Today I'm going to give you a demonstration of Audit Trail, our plugin that allows you to audit changes made in the Razor's Edge. So the first thing to know is that most users won't even know that Audit Trail is running. As they go about making changes and saving those changes, they'll be recorded in the Razor's Edge, but they won't even notice. Your admin and supervisor users can look at these changes in our Audit Trail viewer in the plugin section of the database. So the first thing to do is make some changes. So if we go to the records area, we're going to make some changes to Angela's record here. So first of all, we're going to change her title. We're going to delete her business phone number. And we're going to add an attribute to her record here as well. So we've saved that record and those, say, those changes have been saved to the audit trail as well. So if we now go to our plugin section and open up the viewer, So first of all, just to talk you through some of the options available for looking at your changes. In Audit Trail Basic, you can choose to search by the date the change was made. You can search on a change made to a particular individual's record. Um, and you can also search on the record area. You can drill down to within those record areas as well to specific fields that you want to search on. Today we're going to look through everything. You can also choose to search rec changes made by specific members of your team and you can search on the transaction number as well. So we're going to have a look at changes made today. So then if we hit search, we can see these changes that we made to Angela's record. So first of all, we can see the change we made to her title has changed both the title field and her primary salutation and primary addressee records here as well. We can see that the phone type has been deleted and we can also see that the attribute has been added here. Her salutation has also been changed due to the change to her title. What you can see here is um, the record type, the field name and the old value and then the new value in that field. You can also right click and you can go to the constituents record directly from the audit trail viewer. You can also export this table as an Excel spreadsheet as well. I hope that's given you a good overview of audit trail. To take a look at the more advanced features that it offers, please have a look at our second screencast. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Thanks for listening.